Hello! I'm going to show you how to use a back cane saw and drill jig to prepare back canes for the installation of a Seaton Dynamics dynamic rocker back. Let's start by getting our tools out. Use an M3 Allen key to remove the included drill bit. You will also need an 5mm Allen key, a scale, a whip deburr tool, a level, a file, some cutting oil, a hacksaw, and an electric drill. To begin, clamp the saw drill jig into a vise. Insert the back cane into the jig from the end opposite the saw here end into either the hole mark 7 8 or 1 inch diameter. Measure from the face of the drill block to the appropriate cut length. Using a level, align the back cane push handle so that it is parallel to the jig face marked clamp here. Use the 5mm hex key to tighten the clamp, making sure that you do not over tighten the clamp. Use the hacksaw to cut the back canes to the length. Don't loosen the clamp yet. Use the drill and the included one quarter inch drill bit, as well as some cutting oil, to drill through both walls of the back cane tube at each of the two indicated locations. Continue applying cutting oil as needed. Loosen the clamp screws in preparation for removal of the backing from the jig. Prior to removal, push the backing further out of the saw here end and deburr the recently cut face accordingly. Clean off the back canes, and they're ready for installation. Make sure you also clean your work area and keep your drill jig clean and ready for its next use.